because um, with tears and nervousness, I don't want to miss anything. But um, I guess I always knew that this moment was coming. As being each other's only siblings, Katie and I have always known that we'd be each other's maids of honor. And although I cherish this fact, I have to say that I've always been a little worried. And no, it's not because of the typical maid of honor duties, like going to Hobby Lobby five times a day, <laughs> or tying up your dress about eight times. But um, the part I was always worried about was the speech, because um, as easy as it is to talk about how much I love Katie and Joe and how great they are, um, it's impossible to really let you know how much my big sister and her new husband mean to me. All our lives, it's been the two of us, Kate and Amanda, the Kemichis girls, or sometimes just those really tall girls whose last name we can't pronounce. <laughs> We've shared clothes, stories, laughs, and countless memories. We've shared our entire lives. I can honestly tell you all that my sister made my childhood absolutely awesome. Yes, I always got the second pick when we were sorting clothes for Barbies. <laughs> and yes, when we played school, she actually gave me homework that I had to finish on time and get graded. <laughs> so I think we knew a teacher was always in her future. But um, Kate, I loved every minute of growing up with you. And you taught me so much. And with the help of our awesome parents, um, I think it's safe to say we both turned out pretty great. Now, that's not to say we haven't had our scuffles. Um, some of you know. Sisters, sisters who are a year and a half apart are bound to have their moments, and for us, none are more cutthroat than fighting over who's going to ride shotgun in mom's van. <laughs> we got a little feisty out in the front yard a few times in the driveway, but um, luckily we made it past that, and now we're undoubtedly best friends. We've been blessed to have that special sister relationship that, in Katie's eyes, can really only be compared, compared to the Kardashians. <laughs> I, I do have to say it's pretty special that we've actually had people come up to us and tell us that they hope their young daughters will someday grow up to be as close as we are. And in fact, we've even had complete strangers come up to us at relatives' weddings, inviting us to come to their own weddings because we look like such a good time. <laughs> so, Kate, you are my partner in crime, my personal stylist, my favorite shopping buddy, and my fellow duet partner to some of the best car singing performances that have ever taken place. <laughs> this morning was epic. Um, you've been my other half for my entire life, and you always will be. That said, I could not be happier for you to have met your other half in a different respect. I too remember the first time that Katie told me about Joe. She called me the day after she met him and said, so, my friends and I actually ended up going over to St. Louis last night, and I actually ended up kind of meeting this guy, and I like him. Like, I really like him. Like him. <laughs> and I think I kind of knew from that moment on that Joe was a pretty special guy. It was another few months of phone calls and Skype sessions before I actually met Joe in person, but at that point, I had already felt like I knew him, and that he was part of the family. I think for all of us in this room, we can see how greatly God was involved in bringing these two together. Now, I'm not saying that God was out there on the dance floor with them at Morgan Street that night, but, but somehow it all seemed to be in his plan. It's no doubt that we can tell how unbelievably perfect these two are for each other. Uh, one of the ways that I think of my amazing sister is that there isn't a person in this world who doesn't love her, and I think it's just as safe to say that exact same thing about my new brother, Joe. They're both such happy, positive, caring people that can't help but spread their love and kindness to everyone that they come in contact with. Even though I'm the younger sister, I've always been a little protective of Katie, but I never once had anything to worry about with Joe. I know this because anyone who spends five minutes with them can realize how in love they are. One of my favorite things is watching the way that Joe looks at Katie when she's telling some ridiculous story, or when she's crying at a movie, or really crying at anything for them. <laughs> You can see in those moments, the way that Joe looks at her is that even during her goofiest or craziest times, it just seems to make him love her more. I just really don't think I could have picked a better person to share my best friend with. Joe, I'm so happy to have you join our family and that I can now officially call you my brother. And Kate, like I've said, there will never be enough words to tell you how special you are to me. But part of the great thing about our relationship is that we never really have to say it, we just always know. You are the best role model, best sister, and best friend I could ever ask for. I couldn't be happier for you guys today, and I cannot wait for you two to spend the rest of your lives together. So if we raise our glasses, 
I'll say congratulations and God bless.